Hi, it's Jennifer from Soul Source Tarot, and I'm here to do another daily vibes for you. This is for the 15th, 16th, right around that time. I decided to take these cards back out and go over them because um, as I was watching the reading yesterday that I did, uh, I got this um, message, okay? So I got this message that uh, somebody has been in a solitary confinement, okay? Solitary confinement, okay? Upright. That is a solitary confinement right there, okay? Somebody's been in solitary confinement. This is coming out, coming out of solitary confinement. So somebody is coming out of solitary confinement. They've been restraining themselves. They've been thinking a lot. They've been um, thinking about all the betrayal, thinking about the lies, thinking about the hurt, thinking about the pain. They've been trapped. They have been. They've been trapped, and they've been dealing with it, right? They've been hiding their truth. They've been hiding their pain. They haven't been speaking up, but... It's as though now there's some sort of energy around that is causing somebody to speak up about the deception, the lies, everything that has happened. And when I was pulling these cards back out um, and I put my deck down, I found the justice on the bottom. Okay, so this is this is karma. This is karma, justice, the truth being revealed. This is the law. Okay, this is the law stepping in. This is this in in law comes in many forms. Okay, so this is justice being served in the form of karma consequences. Um, somebody is going to be paying their the dues for their deeds, uh, for keeping somebody confined or for keeping somebody shut up or whatever the case was. Um, so if somebody has been in solitary confinement, whether they're whether they're in uh, prison or whatnot, um, you know th this is coming out of solida solitary confinement. I just gotta put this on, shut this off for a second. So this is coming out. This is coming out of solitary confinement, um, and this is 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 a uh, justified act. Okay, this is. This is meant to happen at this time. Um, we're going to go ahead and get started. I'm going to use this same deck. But I just needed to relay that message. Somebody's been in hiding. They haven't been speaking. But here comes the truth. Here comes the truth. Okay? So, um, yeah. So what do we got for the 15th, 16th, dear God, angels, spirits, and universe? Somebody could be going to court with that justice card. They could be going to court. There could be some legal implications for something. What do we got for the 15th, 16th, dear God, angels, spirits, and universe? Knight of Cups. Now, this is emotional support. Compassion. It's a very intense, sensitive time. This is a very secretive energy as well. Interesting. So the emotional support could be arriving. Somebody's been stabbed in the back. Somebody's been hurt very, very badly. They've been down. They've been down for some time and they've been allowing it. They have been refusing to stand up for themselves. But I think that we we have somebody here that is, is going to stand up for themselves pretty soon. Okay, they might just decide, you know, I, I got to take these swords out of my back and I got to stand up and fight. So this is the end. It's the end of a painful, stressful situation where somebody has been down. This person has been allowing themselves to be down. They've been very emotional. I just noticed this, the, the choppy uh, waters behind them. Things have been... Uh, there's, it's been quite a challenge. There's a lot of clouds here. You know, there's been some problems. Somebody has been confused, you know, trying to, wondering why, 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 why is this happening? You know, what did I do to deserve this? Um, now, whoever they're dealing with, this could be a father figure. 
This is somebody who may have received some poor counsel. This person, somebody is having a hard time doing the right thing due to society. Um, we have somebody here that ha is under a lot of social pressure and they may feel like they this is disgrace this is disgrace they will be disgraced I'm going to put this card right here because that seems to be separate. That is social pressure. Somebody is not very spiritual. They're not very awakened. They don't have a lot of faith. We could have a relationship that is not on the same page. This is, this is an authority figure who is using their authority in the wrong way. This person absolutely cannot do the right thing because of disgrace, fear of disgrace. Yeah, we got somebody here that just can't take the right action. This person is stalling, trying to stop something, does not want to be disgraced, does not want to be embarrassed, One more card for this pair of font reversed. Now, this Eight of Cups reversed, this is thinking a lot. We have somebody here that is thinking a lot about what they should do. Should they, should they, uh, leave this situation or should they keep trying to prove themselves? It's like they don't want to say goodbye, but because they because of because of social pressure, it's like they're trying to keep somebody from leaving. They are. This person is trying to keep somebody from leaving. It is somebody is trying to keep somebody from leaving for selfish reasons. Let's go over here now. Emotional support is arriving for this person that is down on their knees, down on the ground, in complete despair, that has been suffering. Emotional support is arriving for this person that has been suffering. Somebody may put a stop to it, the chariot reverse. This is putting a stop to it. We got this is definitely a very emotional time. I saw it right here. Very challenging, very emotional. All three of these cards. Somebody is dealing, they may be crying, they could be even having some sort of outburst. This is not being able to master emotions. This is too much. It's very, this hurts. This hurts too much. So I think it's going to be a very emotional time. Um, somebody has been living in fear. But I think they're going to expose, this is exposing the truth. Somebody is going to expose the truth even though they have fear. They just can't do it anymore. They can't, they can't, they can't do it anymore. They may, somebody may gain their trust. This person is very feeling, very kind, and very compassionate. Somebody may gain their trust. This is the truth coming out about a very painful situation. This person has been avoiding, but it's like they've lost their will. This is loss of willpower. It's like they've lost their will. They've lost their will to live. Being controlled by a very unhealthy situation. Somebody has been controlled. Highly controlled. But this is taking back power. This is freedom. Somebody is going to be taking back control from a situation. It's like they, they, somebody is, is exposing the lies and taking back their power, taking back control. It's like they have to stand up for themselves because if they don't, they, they're going to die in this situation. So it's like, they, it's like, I got to stand up for myself and tell the truth because this is telling the truth. So I think there's somebody that comes in and offers emotional support. 
Maybe it's protection, somebody in protection, because this is protection. They may be being questioned. Somebody may be, be being questioned by several people. This person has their guard up, though. Definitely scared. Somebody is definitely scared, no doubt. They've been manipulated for quite some time. So they're da that's why they're so scared. Could be dealing with an Aries Leo Sagittarius who is very demanding, controlling, has their own self image problem. This person is uh, very prideful, angry. Now, somebody is, is probably feeling like they need to defend themselves. We could be dealing with a, a Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, a Capricorn, a Cancer, a, a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio. But this is the need to protect. I gotta protect myself because this there's no there's no fertility here. There's no growth here. This person is very demanding and uh controlling I just see look at the red it's so controlling very much controlling and it's like somebody is going to be defending themselves it's like I got to do what's right for me this person is lazy and, and may play the victim Doesn't have any get up and go. Maybe lacking vision. Maybe on a low vibration. This is a low vibrational person right here. Selfish. Very, very selfish. And mean. We got somebody here that is being very mean. Now this is taking back control. This could be the law stepping in. This is an investigator. There could be an investigator that is, that is invest, could even be a private investigator. It could be a private investigator. There could be an investigator, because it doesn't have to be private investigator. There's so many inve different kinds of investigators in the world. It's like that we have somebody here that is going to see a situation completely clearly. And they may be deciding that they need to step in and protect. I'm just saying this is protection of some sort. Somebody is definitely going to be questioned. Somebody's been down, really, really down with that Ten of Swords, down on their knees, really, really hurting. But this is emotional support. <laughs> One more card for this side. Then we're going to go back over to the other side. This is a loss of some sort. This is a dead end. And it is a dead end. Somebody has lost their focus. They've lost their concentration. They didn't follow through. They went down the wrong path. They lack moral integrity and backbone. They didn't do the right thing. And now they're about to experience a loss. It's like somebody is going to see a situation clearly and they're going to make some sort of decision. This person is some sort of investigator. Let's go back over here to this. This is a, a father figure type of person. Or it's somebody that is under a lot of social pressure to prove something to society they're trying to stop somebody from walking away or from leaving that's what they're trying to do could have to do with children could have to do with somebody that they have a lot of memories with there's not any love there there's no love there's no compassion 
they could be uh, playing the victim. They may they may play that victim card. They may use a ma emotional blackmail as a tactic to keep this person down. That's why this person is begging. It's it, it is suffering so badly because this person has used emotional blackmail to make them feel like they need to stay in this situation. Don't to stay. They've caused this person a lot of fear. This person has with their emotional blackmail. Ten of Pentacles. This is this has to do with family. It has to do with home. Somebody may be traveling. This is the end of a family dynamic. It's a ten. It's a completion. I know a lot of readers don't read it like that, but if you look up tens, tens are completions. This is the end of something in the family. This is traveling. This is moving. Somebody may be moving. Headed towards something more comfortable. More stable. More solid. More secure. But something needs to end first. That is emotionally uh, not available. Somebody has been, you know, really, really holding on and not letting somebody leave. Oh, goodness, the hermit. This is a time of reflection. Isolation. Somebody has been isolating, hiding. Definitely thinking. This one is thinking, and this is thinking. The Eight of Cups reversed. Thinking about the memories. Thinking about the past but there's no growth there's no fertility there there's no excitement there's also no vi no vision and somebody has has been stopping somebody from taking action Somebody has been weighed down by something weighed down by it could be a mother or a father weighed down by the memories causing somebody not to grow there's no growth here there's lack of growth now we have a fresh new start a new beginning starting over breaking free freedom this is freedom somebody is going to be breaking free from something that has no growth Now, this is a card of consequences. There's consequences for your choices. There's consequences for your actions. Somebody has been in a state of confusion, and they probably made a wrong choice. And they may suffer some consequences, and they may be going on their own way and, and just leaving everything else behind. This is starting over from scratch, starting at zero by yourself. So... This is losing something that has no growth. Okay, it's just, it's, it's a loss. This is a loss. Somebody made a poor decision. And now they may be suffering some sort of consequences. Now, but that, but, this is a new beginning. Consider this a an opportunity to start over. Consider this an exciting opportunity to start fresh and to choose a better option next time. Make a better choice. So it feels like somebody is going to be uh, leaving. They are going to be leaving. They, there's been a delay though. There's been a delay because of somebody's need to control. Oh, clinging to control. Thank you, God. Thank you, God. So that is clinging control. That's, that's the meaning of the card reversed. Somebody's been clinging to control. But you can't fight destiny only so much. So somebody has been stopping. They have. Somebody has been stopping somebody from leaving. I knew it. I knew it. I knew it. But. But. I feel as though we have. We have somebody over here some sort of investigator or something like that this person this person could be a lawyer it could be an investigator this could be 
uh, police officer. This is somebody in protection. This guy doesn't look very happy at all. He's not happy. He's not happy with something. What is this King of Swords? What is he going to do? This is somebody that um, is very decisive. He sees things clearly. He's very intellectual. He makes a he makes a, a, a quick decision too. He does. Judgment. This is some sort of investigator of some sort. It's like he's gonna see something and he's gonna make a judgment call. Somebody is going to be judged very, very, very soon. And this is your other card of karma. This is bad karma, bad luck. Somebody is going to experience a run of bad luck, bad karma for trying to stop somebody from moving on, for keep keeping somebody under their control. They're about to experience some bad karma. This person is going to make a judgment call and it's like they're coming to help. This is some sort of truth, a secret that is being revealed. This is also a release. Somebody is going to be released from a painful situation. Could have something to do. I just split the deck with the Queen of Swords. This could also be a law. Uh, uh, the law. This could be a lawyer. This is somebody who is very... Uh, this person is a quick thinker. This person is very wise. This person is also very intellectual. Um, very assertive and calculating. Very intense as well. This person um, speaks the truth. She's very authentic. She knows the truth. She doesn't back down. We could have something to do with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius here that is 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 telling the truth. Somebody's telling the truth. It's like, I can't live like this anymore. Here it comes. So be prepared for some sort of truth to be revealed about a situation. And I know we've been talking about this a lot. A, a decision, seriously. decision. Deci a decision is being made. To restore control, to take back power away, to take power away from somebody. Could be two people. Somebody has been clinging to control because of social pressure. And, they, and, and, and it's like now there's some sort of realization. This is a realization that this is, this needs to end. Something is going to come to a complete halt, a complete stop with this chariot reversed. Somebody's uh, manipulation and control. It's like done. It is. It's the end. Somebody's going to make an, a judgment call. Against a person or against a couple of people. It's time. It's time for a change. There could also be an exchange. And there could be a reunion. This hurts. It's painful. Somebody's been suffering. This is a painful separation. That's what this is. So there's about to be a painful separation. Good luck. <laughs>